What's up? This is your boy Super, and I'm playing Fade to Silence. A post apocalyptic survival horror game in the frozen tundra. It's also a Souls like. Very more Souls like. Very, very more Dark Souls like than Demon Souls like. I've just been playing Demon Souls on the PS5 and read this thought, I give it a try because I also like survival games. It's so like spirit energy monsters and uh, crafting food and shelter and things like that and weapons and managing your warmth. All fun, good, good stuff. Let's check our inventory, see what we got. We got some food, we got some here healing items, we got some torches, we got some arrows, we got an axe, we got a pickaxe, we got a purse, we got a sword, and we got a jacket. So, we can actually upgrade our jacket, or we might need one or two more things. And the, the object is you gotta go reclaim their sites. You got a wood site, to go reclaim it, you chop down one tree on it, and then your survivors will go harvest wood there when they're not doing anything else. And you can command your survivors to build how build buildings, gather resources, and hunt. I'm not sure you can. No, you can't. I thought you. There, there's also nests you got to clear out of like spirit monsters or whatever they are. But you, you, your survivors can come in a party with you, but they can't do it by themselves. We're, we don't have any more ore. All our ore sites are depleted. So I think I'm gonna go to this ore site right here. And. Mine up to the war. Oh, here's one we got right here. God, well, let's go check so on. Good. Yeah, and your daughter I'm is uh, really, really hungry. About 13 or 14. She's starving to death. Well, if she's hungry, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna send Reese to gather some food. We've got. We only got one hunting spot that's currently claimed, but we'll send him there to get you some food, sweetheart. What is he doing now? He's already hunting. Good job. Good job, my man. Good job. We just completed the second building, which is the crafting hut. If you had another, your follower can take the junk wood and make it into good wood. Was arguing with himself about but he's, or something. he's not a good enough crafter to do it, though. But I have to keep going. I can't stop now. This is just a hut for him to sleep so he can have his own resources and not mooch off of ours. This is a butcher's corner to turn tainted meat into good meat. That's actually a good next step. Reese, come back and work on this building. And since Reese is working on the building, we can go gather the resources we need. What, what do we got? What is it? I wish there was a little tool tip that said what the buildings are, but... There's a legend, the followers hut. You can also get dog sleds in this game, which is really awesome. Whoa, whoa, didn't mean to do that. This wood is about depleted. So we're gonna go finish it up. You got some food in there, go cook it. The corruption is spreading across the land. Beware of the blight. She never stops nagging. Oh yeah, this is the site where I couldn't find the last of the trees. Oh, here it is. Last tree here.
So it looks like there's more trees left here. Yep. But I'm gonna get these back so we can finish the building. <clears throat> well, we need to find another survivor. So we can go ahead and eat some food. Explore, survive, and unearth the past. Yeah. The veil, the construction site. Hey, you're back. Yeah, baby, I'm back. Your supplies are dangerously low. and all this to storage here. How's it looking now? Looks like we need a lot of firewood. There's the giant ball monster that floats around the area. And it gathers as much wood as we can. We need lots and lots and lots of it. This game is like non-stop gathering resources. In the flats. Says there's more trees here, but I don't see them. Where are they? The trees. It says there's more trees here. Where are they, dear? the trees ah, I'd like to find the trees of hope the trees of life the trees of love and the trees of your wife miracles <laughs> I don't see any trees go to another location let's get to mine this area right there no I do not want to send a worker there I want to go there myself on the ground over there. Okay, we're close to the... So we should be looking right at the mining place. Here we go. I can't pick that up. I 
Cannot pick that up, it's stuck in the ground. Tree place then. Just right there. There's a bag. A veil creep. There's a tree. Chop, 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 chop. Bunch of wood. Business now. All right. Hmm. Thought something was following me. terrible living in a place like this not only freezing cold and lack of resources but you got monsters everywhere not just monsters spiritual ghostly monsters insane Velcreep, pristine wood tainted wood Eighteen degrees out. Let's see what's happening over here. Looks like we don't have any food. Just not good. Not good at all. Where is my follower? Wrong button. He's kind of hungry. He's warm. He's only a little tired, so he should be awake pretty soon. We could actually send him out right now. Well, he's a big drain on the camp. We're going to let him choose what he does. Assign to expedition. Tell him to rest and heal or gather. We actually need some food. I think I'll actually go and do the food. He can build the hut for now. What? Crafting, what can we craft? We need some food, but we don't have any food. I'll sleep. Three hours. Eat my last food. I think I better go hunting. We obviously can't depend on him. Reese has been sneaking off. What's he up to? Let's check his progress on the butcher hut. Sixty two percent. I 
Let's uh, watch and see if they have any idle animations. I've actually got to do something else with it. Something to occupy us. Hold on a sec. It might actually be better to wait until he's finished with the building to go hunt. But he he's, does, has no skills in butchering, so that's going to be useless when it's finished. He's, he, he can only use the forge, the craft table, and some type of altar for occultism. He can't use the butcher or the woodcutter. Or anything else. He can still hunt though. He's going to have to do that right here in a minute. like a kind of like a boat for a second I hear you growling I'm ready for you when you're ready come up to get me Also got some prize. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Down you go. I oh, got me. Race, you aren't supposed to be hunting. You're supposed to be working on a building. For the law. What do we got here? Elder Chested Sparkstone. Useless. There's a deer. There's a deer. We got a nice opportunity here if he slows down and stops to eat or something. We went a little too fast for me. We're so close though. I think we ruined our, our chance here. Oh, he's coming right back. He's gonna run right into me. Gotta aim a little high. We didn't even get no blood. He's running pretty far. Oh, he's bleeding. He, he died. Or, no, he didn't die yet, but he's bleeding. I'm on the trail. Pristine remains and 24 tainted remains. Not bad, not bad. And I'll go to this safe house, safe house over here and cook up this meat. 
then come right back to the hunting spot. That works out neat. A little hunting blind. This is not it, is it? This is just the building. Where is that? Yeah, this is it. How come I can't get... Oh, there it is. Light the barrel. The safe place to rest. You Cook just some. Rami, 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 There we go. Pristine remains are good for other I things to craft. Uh, which way? Over here. There's something on the ground over here. I'll go grab that. White bane, flame. So, I imagine this is the hunting spot I had marked over here. Just gotta keep our eyes open. We're looking for a deer. Blight bane, blight bane. Looks like a. Oh no. Uh, uh, blizzard's rolling and we gotta head home. Can't see the marker. I think it might be a better idea just to go to the shelter over here. That's the long run back to base. Well, it hasn't said there's a blizzard coming in yet, coming in yet, so we got plenty of time, I'd imagine. There's a monster somewhere around here. Got some more firewood. Nice place to put a shelter right here with all the spikes. A lot of running back and forth, I tell ya. Looks like we're about home. Let's see what we can send to storage here. The firewood. Hi Dad. My stomach the white vein. Eldritch essence. Pristine remains. Tainted remains. And sparkstone. Let's send Reese. Okay, he's, sl he's sleeping. Okay. We can go ahead and sleep, I guess. Wow, we're running out of firewood. Anything to break the monotony of my own thoughts. Let's go ahead and eat one. Oops, now let's go ahead and sleep. Two hours is alright, I guess. Guess we can eat again. Okay, now let's see if we can send him out to hunt. He's sleeping still, so how was he talking to me if he's sleeping? Not sense does make it. This makes sense. That hunting spot sure is far away. 
Well, screw his sleep schedule. Let's go let's send him to hunt. They gotta stay fed somehow. Actually, let's put him on. He can decide tasks for himself. And he, he stays hunting because he knows he, that's what needs to be done. Oh no, now he's cutting wood. I think we need to go find another survivor, so we gotta go to the edge of that. We gotta go into another area here, I'd assume. We can, uh, jeez, I don't know. We've got to run through this game quickly. I can't be, the wall's way out of sight. The eclipse, that's what it's called. What's the closest thing to us? The, the nest. Let's go to get the nest. All right, so we able to take care of things. Uh, we could at least clear the nest before we move on. They should be able to get the resources themselves. To the right. Okay, I see it. Three degrees out. Twenty degrees on a good day, three degrees at night. Not a place I'd like to be. Cleanse this mess. Alright, alright. Got it. Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence, Warming Shard, Search the Bag, A Dying Ember Salvage. Now where should we go next? There's uh, the Eclipse is over here. We got one, two, three, four, five. Oh, actually, we got three small nests and the big nest. I think that's what that big one is. Yeah, corrupted outposts. I don't know what we can do with the eclipse, but let's get all the nests out of here. So I take it Rice is still cutting wood. He does it very slowly. I would have already been, been on my second tree by now. Oh, well, he might be on his second tree by now. It just didn't tell me. What do we have here? of arrows and they can never have too many arrows As a matter of fact I should equip them there we go I think we got some goodies here oh, that's an enemy I got some goodies an enemy is a goodie I guess some Eldritch Essence. And there's the Eclipse was over there. I don't know where it went. Oh crap, I didn't see where I was walking. Didn't pay attention to where I was walking. Go ahead and cleanse this. So he cleanses it with his mind, huh? Another one down. So we've got Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence. Warming Shard, Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence. And a bag. A Dying Ember, salvage. Now the bad thing is the next outposts, I mean the next, uh, 
nests are behind outposts. So that's gonna be a little more dangerous. Salvage in a bag. Rice has depleted the grove of trees. We got grub, grub root and something else. Now that he's depleted all the trees, he's on to hunting. Good man, good man. Check this bag right here. Firewood. You can never have too much firewood. Salvage. You can never have too much salvage. And we got another bag. Two bags. A chest and a bag, it looks like. Alright. Firewood, primitive arrows, and salvage. Over here we've got an orb and a box. A locked box. Those are always nice. Okay, we got a monster it looks like. He's down. In the locked box we have dun -da -da -da. Firewood, healing tonic, primitive arrows, and salvage. Another monster, another monster. Right behind us, right behind us. Oh, he, that was a good shot, my man. But you're not tough enough to handle me. And in the orb, we got a bag with. Eldritch Essence. Let's get the hell out of here and head on to... So there's the outpost and there's two nests behind the outpost up in the top here. These ones over here are in a different area it looks like. So let's head to the, the nest behind the outpost. And then after we clear all the nests and the outpost we can move on to the next section and rice can be the one to gather supplies and do the the uh the tedious survival tasks and we've ventured forth through the monstrous realm that is the veil vale. thought i saw something highlighted over there there we go yeah took a second yeah, healing tonic, grub root, blood hall. Well, let's put the small healing items on the quick slot and use them first. See, this has a one by it, Roman numeral one. This has a Roman numeral two. Slowly restores a fraction of your current health. Elder Tremony gradually restores a fraction of your maximum health. So we'll equip these ones. I thought I had the small, the, the big ones equipped, but I already had the small ones equipped. Find a way to the top of this peak here. Oh, wow, I didn't expect to be able to get up here. What is that? That's a shard to upgrade. A nourishing shard. That'll help us with our uh, appetite and whatnot. Awesome. So, uh, awesomeness. There's an outpost, there's a uh, nest right there. We got some plants. There's a here's a uh, tree chopping spot, firewood spot. And there's a new shelter discovered. Alright. We will leave the firewood for him. Grab this. Even though I don't have a use for it just quite yet. This is a very long game. Very long. There's the shelter. Survival book updated with what? Monster raids rebuilding. Oh, raids are going to come attack your structures. And you got to protect them. Outposts. 
cleanse outpost to drive back the blight and reclaim large resource stockpiles. Cleansing an outpost also reveals on un all unexplored locations in the region of the map, including undiscovered groves and hunting grounds. If you're low on resources, taking back an outpost may be just what you need to do to keep going. We'll check the shelter and get the nest first, but I hear ya. Can't take the spark stone. No, search the bag. Rubber root fiber. What we will do is put like three fire, four, three firewood in here. Can I get warm? See if we can cook anything. We can cook stuff with grub root. We can make healing potion, which, all, which also consumes grub root. And these are both level one healing potions. Slowly restores a fraction of your current health, or slowly regenerates a sliver of your maximum health. I don't know. We'll check our inventory. What are we doing on here? Looks like we got plus two on warming shards, plus two installation, insulation. That's awesome. We've got plus one on nourishment, sustenance. We really need something to eat. We'll, so let's get something to eat. Got a bunch of junk. I don't know which is better, a healing potion or an Eldritch Remedy. Healing. They both use health, Eldritch Energy. Let's go ahead and craft another. With each craft you get three of them, so now we've got five. That's pretty good, that's pretty good. We've got a lot of healing stuff actually. We've got one level two, one, two level ones, and then five of the different kinds. It's taking up too much space in our inventory. Can we sleep? We can sleep for We're already warm, so let's get out of here. And can we pick up the spark stone? Yes. And on to the nest we go. Dang it. Gonna try and roll, but he was too quick. I just saw something on the ground. Where did it go? This is kind of like The Witcher. Got a bag with healing poultices, grub root, blood haw, blight vein, fiber. Can't take either of those. Got some more food. Cleanse the outpost. To cleanse the outpost, you gotta sneak into the nest. Is that what you're telling me over in the mission corner there? Cleansing the outpost and zero of two ne nests are cleansed. So I see the outpost and I see one nest. Oh, this is not, this is nasty. This is not good. How you kill the hellvine? You gotta do light light attacks because why am I stuck in place? What was going on? You gotta do light attacks because their attacks are too quick. All right, there we go. One or two nests cleared. What is that? He ate a dog? Is that gonna be our friend? Oh. 
Man's best friend. Yeah, you rescued a tamed wolf. It'll show show up at a sledding kennel you built. So now we got an eldritch essence. We got to build a sled kennel to get our animal stock to pile. Warming shard and a bunch of eldritch essence and a bag like normal. We got our first dog for the dog sled. Got undying ember and salvage. We can't get it. Not yet, anyway. So is that the last nest or is that the outpost? I don't see. Okay, I'm at the last. I'm looking. Yeah, that's the last nest. The outpost is to the left, right there. Rice is hunting. Well, good job, Rice. There's, we got the spitter over there. Okay, that's just a sign. Looks like he's go going in the opposite direction. So I'll go cleanse the outpost. Oh crap, Splitter got me. Alright. Oh, we got a second second wolf for the uh, bobsled, or the dog sled. Got a nourishing shard, a bunch of Eldritch Essence, Eldritch Essence. Don't see a bag. Oh, there it is. Eliminate the Guardian. I wonder where the Guardian is. In the outpost? You guessed it. He's running, what the hell? Okay, let's go check out this building. We're gonna have to come back and loot this area because we don't have enough inventory space for anything. We need, there's a lot of salvage here. We're gonna have to remember at the first outpost there's a lot of salvage laying around. Back up, Jack. Back up. 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 Eldritch Essence. That looks like there's a pokey thing in here. Oh, we can turn this into a safe haven. Or uh, what do you call it? A shelter place? That'll be nice. What do we got to do for it? We can't get to the barrel. Right here, there's a... Cleanse, right here. Easy. This area is cleansed. First outpost down. Area revealed. So we've got one nest up in this corner. I would imagine these small dots with no markings are uh, just points of interest. All right, we got another shelter here. What is that? You gained a boon for your next reincarnation. What do you mean by that? My next reincarnation? What are you talking about? Sliver, we got a sliver of hope. So this is the roguelike. For the next, for when we get a game over, what we come back with next time, that's weird. I might as well start with a large supply of firewood. Only your final death will grant you what you seek. So we gotta wait till we die to be able to use that the final time. That's weird how we got lives and we... What is that over there? Why are you telling me to search that way over there, man? What are you talking about? Okay, it's telling me all, where all the resources are. 
Well, we might need to take a nap and nothing up here. Oh, storage. Oh, we've got another. This, this is the same stash. Yes, yes, it is. Awesome. So keep those six firewood. Put the big healing in there. Put some primitive arrows in there. Put the grub root in there. The light blade, vein, elder chestnuts, undying ember, spark stone, and salvage. Now, um, I'm not sure what we should do next. So let's, uh, oh, we're already warm and everything. We should eat though, so let's eat. Now the uh, multiple uh, shelters is making sense because they got uh, attached storage. I guess let's just loot this place since we're right here anyway. Get all the little bits and bobs. I'm having trouble seeing. Awesome. Awesome. Why would I put a firewood in bag? Unlock your lockbox. Awesome. There's a, there's a big claw daddy over there. A ripper, that's what they're called, not claw daddy. Daddy long claws. Some more eldritch essence. Let's get back to our lockbox here. How dare he disturb me. Healing tonic, torch, primitive arrows. Might as well go to the ones they're telling me to go to. There's a fallen tree over there. It's mighty far away though. Oh, these are the ones that I couldn't get before and they marked them for me. That was that's a really cool feature. All the stuff you had to be leave you had to leave behind is marked for you. That's cool. There's another outpost over there. We're pretty close to it. We I, we can't even yeah. Yeah, we can see it. Wow. See the scale is, is weird. It looks a lot closer than it than it, it looks farther away than it is. That was cool how the truck said fell. Let's go up this mountain here. Might as well use our torches. There's a... Uh, that's the tower. We have here got salvage. I don't remember being over here. Some firewood. My followers are seeking shelter from a blizzard. It would, sounds like a good idea. shelter from the blizzard. Inventory is full. Yep, and there's the blizzard. Send the storage. God. 
Got a lot of healing supplies. I wonder how my knife got unequipped. Oh, because I'm equipped. I have my torch equipped. Let's see if we can get some sleep. Oh, we can get a lot of sleep. Still howling and everything out there. So we can, uh. What is this? Outpost the circle of torment perpetuates your cursed, exi dying and exi cursed existence in this dying world. There is no escape. Each death only prolongs your suffering, snuffing out a flame of hope. Once the last flame is extinguished, you will lose everything and reincarnate in the past. A new cycle begins, but there is still hope. Oops. Slivers of hope come into being when you first cleanse a warding crystal in an outpost to recover key memories. They will stay with you even beyond permadeath and grant you boons when you reincarnate. Boons meddle with the circle of torment, allowing you to gain or preserve advantages you earned in the previous cycle for the next. Teleporting. All warding crystals are linked. You can use them to teleport between cleansed outposts or your refuge. Sledding. Well, so we can fast travel between uh, these places. Let's see what we, what we can't construct here. Oops. So we can, we can, that's cool, we can teleport bes between outposts. So what do we got left to do on this map? Just a bunch of resources. Let's actually send Reese to mine. Oh, we can't, because we haven't claimed that area. We can send him to mine this area. Right now he's chopping wood. He needs a healing potion. I think I'm going to teleport back to my original place and wrap up the video, hold the teleport, the flats, or refuge, the refuge, let's go to the refuge, teleport and initiated, you have activated a teleportation crystal, and there you go. Hiya. Allie, Hi. I the corrupted building and cleansed it. There's a crystal inside that protects us, just like in the camp. But you'll be safe there, right? You're sure it's not a trap? Don't worry, Allie. It's just as safe there as in the camp. Maybe you'll find others. Maybe you can even find piles and piles of supplies at the cargo ship. Yeah, maybe. So we don't have any firewood, so I'll go ahead and add the firewood here. Go ahead and see if we can craft that <clears throat> better shirt, which is scrap plating. We actually don't need that, and the, the padded clothing is actually better. But we do need to sit by the fire for a while, and we don't need to craft anything else. Uh, makeshift shelter is good for when you're out there I'm assuming take that in a campfire and you can stay warm but other than that there's not really too much we need we could, I think maybe we could make another woven pouch do they stack I don't know if those stack if they stack we should definitely do that guess we can try and sleep and see if we can get this frostbite off us Race is freezing. I thought we had tons and tons of wood. I must have nourishment. Let's take some pristine wood. We need a woodworker. We definitely need a woodworker. Unless I can do it myself. Let's use. We can use two of my torches for firewood. I only need one. Don't even really need one. And the pristine wood. I can do that. Alright, 
now we have 38 firewood. I want to put them in here and let them use it themselves. I did not want to do that. I'm taking food. I'm taking those healing potions. I'm taking my torch. I'm taking axe, pickaxe, knife. And that's all I'm taking, I guess. Got my knife and my torch equipped, my healing potions equipped, my food equipped. I can eat some food. No, it raises warm. Suggest the validity of my studies is tainted. But it is only by becoming one with the creatures' minds that we begin to understand them. Rascal, I found a wolf. What was I gonna do? We send rice to gather some firewood. Alice, a wolf is a wild animal, not a pet. Okay, Dad, I'll be careful. You know, I bet a wolf could pull a sled, if we had one. Excellent plan. But you don't remember destroying the last sled, do you? Wow. So it's a crafting, survival, souls-like horror game. Which is also a rogue like this is crazy. It just gets deeper and deeper. So, Rascal, what did you get up to while I was gone? We said that the world would end in seven days. But didn't it end already, Dad? It certainly did. So I can't even craft none of this, huh? How much wood would that go us? 36 regular wood and 3 pristine wood, that'd be a lot of wood. I'm hungry. I need something to eat. Okay. Well, I'm gonna send him back on his, let him choose his own task. Because he knows what he needs better than I do. And I'm gonna end this episode right here. So it's your boy, Soup. We're playing Fade to Silence. I hope you enjoyed it. It would help me out a lot if you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next episode.